Hey guys, I go by the name of Illuminous Eyes. I'm here to illuminate the motherfucking wise. All right, today we got a really quick card pull. This one will be for Scorpio. All right, Scorpio. That is a random ass thing that can happen to me. You, someone could be frightening you, scaring you. Okay, this could be coming from an air sign. Look at straight up in my fucking hand. Five of Swords. Okay, I feel like someone just scared the shit out of you, or they're trying to scare you. This, you guys could be scared of the justice system, going through legal matters right now. But I'm getting that with the justice card coming out. Justice will be served to you. Truth is going to be restored to you somehow. I'm also getting that if you have, if you had to pay the price for something, especially like legal situation, Scorpio. I'm getting that I'm getting that it's gonna go in your fucking favor. Okay? I'm also getting that the air sign does not fucking win. Okay? You win. Although this justice card comes out, you fucking win. I'm hearing Nicki Minaj. I win and you lose. <laughs> That's what I hear. Could you tell me why the justice card is here for a fucking Scorpio? Can you tell me why the justice card is here for Scorpio? Yeah, I'm also getting because you're working hard on yourself or you're working hard on something. I'm also getting that God he is a Libra. God is working hard in your favor, Scorpio. He's trying so hard to um, inspire you. He's, he's. I'm also getting that he's trying to restore some hope in you, okay, or some passion in you. Scorpio, God is working really hard in your favor. Eight of Pentacles. Okay, I'm also getting that if you guys are working on something in specifically, I don't know if this is like um, contracts, uh a business i don't know i feel like you have the you have the intellect to get whatever this is done i'm hearing baby boomer or baby business okay so something's about to boom or something's about to something's about to like be prosperous okay great fucking idea i'm also getting that <laughs> i'm gonna say it because why not scorpio i'm getting that somebody at work is talking about your phallic size i'm getting that someone is saying damn scorpio got a big dick or 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 a uh, scorpio is fine okay you're you're ringing name you're ringing your name is ringing okay moving on from that because that's too sexual can i get a card please yeah someone <laughs> we got the ace of we got the ace of uh swords in the page of pinnacles right here so yeah this is a you guys could be having a sexual conversation right now with an earth sign or an air sign i'm getting that they're easily seduced by the things that you say okay i'm also getting that you make someone feel really really fucking good i'm hearing like take me to ecstasy i'll take you to ecstasy this or someone may feel like this from you okay scorpio others of you are going through a situation where you're filing a divorce you're breaking up with someone I'm also hearing that someone may want to apologize to you. Someone's work writing something, writing down an apology. This could be coming in the form of a text message. Okay. Some of you guys need to work on your throat chakra. Because you you're emotionally imbalanced right now. Because you 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 received some truth about an earth sign or an air sign. Okay, can I get a card please for Scorpio? Moving on, man. Moving on. Yeah, some of you guys need to rest, okay? Some of you guys are lacking rest. You're burnt the fuck out. You guys could be staying up late at night listening to music or watching TV or on the computer. Or you guys could be staying up at night working on something. I'm also getting that your eyes is extremely fixated on something like a screen, a phone, okay? I'm, I, I'm getting that you're having a hard time like breaking away from this okay you need to break away give it a rest okay so I'm also getting that there could be an air sign that's trying to give you some some um, advice about what to do in regards to your relationship I'm getting that it's great fucking advice okay Scorpio it, 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 it because uh, if this could be financial advice work advice but I'm getting that it's great fucking advice take it okay we do have the um uh, I don't want to pull that card because every time I pull it, I see fucking dick. Okay, I'm also getting that. I'm getting that if Scorpio, if you can't work something out with someone, it's better. It's better to just walk away, leave it alone because at this point, it's become manipulative. It's become a manipulating, okay, and overbearing and uh, obsessive. Some of you guys are just obsessively watching tarot. Even while you're at fucking work. Some of you guys need to act a tarot reader or someone more experienced about your children's future. Because I feel like you may have gotten advice from someone that is new to tarot or new or something like that. Moving on. Last card please for Scorpio. Let me get one card please for Scorpio. 
One last card, please, for Scorpio. Yeah. Okay, so some of you guys, some of you guys have a bill that's coming up, okay, and you're working really hard to pay it. Okay, I'm getting that you could have you could have been um ignoring this bill, this utility, or whatever this is for a while, but it's time to get to get it done. Some of you guys have an ex that is like not coming back. You guys are broken up. You guys need to stay focused on yourself, replenishing your own self, because I feel like you're focused on someone coming back to you, but they're not. Move on. Someone could feel like this about you. Are you going to come back after a breakup? Someone feels feels bad almost for cheating or leaving with someone else, being with someone else. But I feel like I feel like if this person has already left, they're not coming back. And if they do come back, they will have nothing but intentions just for this to be based off of sex or lust or be to be manipulative. Why go through that? Some of you guys are coming out of a period of feeling depressed and alone. Some of you guys feel like you're a single mother or a single woman and you're all by yourself. It takes work to be happy. Happiness is so hard. To be depressed is so easy. And you don't need that type of energy. All right? <laughs> 